What's up, Red Pill Racing? What we got today is a lineup of 2018 Hot Wheels. We're gonna run these bad boys, crack and track, no graphite, against some older castings that seem to match up pretty well. So, first up, what we're gonna have the Solar Reflex. So, never really raced this car very much, but I mean, it seems aerodynamic, and it is going to be racing from 2001, the Road Rocket, the PR5s. That should be a good matchup there. The next race will be the Trek Hammer. I've bought like five of four, five of these. Haven't raced any of them yet, so it'll be interesting to see how that one does against a casting. I've bought a bunch of used ones from. This is the first new one I've got. I think it's the Mad Fast. I keep wanting to mod one of these, and for some reason, I never do. Uh, this one's actually a little bit newer than the others. Uh, the Mad Fest from 2011. Next matchup will be the 2018 Cyber Speeder and the 2001 Maelstrom. Those are pretty similar cars. Totally different wheels. The Cyber Speeder's actually got a little bit longer wheelbase. Pretty good matchup, I believe. That uh, a Maelstrom is the 2001 first edition, and the wheels are some of those are fast wheels. So, next up, a car I just recently found the Ford Focus with the kind of strange graphics 2018. It is gonna be racing against the 2000. Pikes Peak Celica. My first car was a Celica. I like all the Celicas. I haven't found one that's real fast, but I haven't raced one of these fresh out of the pack, so let's see. Next up, one of my favorite new castings this year. Well, not a new casting, but uh, new colors. Bulletproof. I love the bulletproof cars. Sent one to Diecast 64 last month and finished uh, second. You're going to have a tough matchup though. The Arrow Flash. These things are pretty quick usually. I haven't had but a couple that are fresh new out of the pack and I think they're both done. But, uh, this thing's from 97. Probably the, I think the oldest car that I opened. Next up from the Target Decades Collection. That good looking Viper and fat tires on the back. Who's he facing? Another 01 first edition Hot oh, Wheels Viper. We'll do these races just like we did yesterday. Uh, we'll run heads up, see which one wins. The 2018s are the old ones, and uh, then we'll play it on out for a winner. It's a good looking Mustang, again from that Decades collection. The target it does have the fat tires, which sometimes tend to slow it down. And he is racing probably the heaviest car in this group, but I don't have a lot of faith in it. Johnny Lightning, and it's uh, obviously a year 2000, July 4th, 2000. Let's see how it does. Last race. One of my favorite castings. I've raced probably four of these on my track, tested them, and they have all been disappointing. This one seems to run a little bit better than Custom Maverick, and he's going to be facing off with that 442. So if it, uh, comes down to needing a win to tie it up in the last race, that's, that's who we're going to be depending on. Who's going to get it? New cars, old cars. I think most people would say it's going to be the 
the old cars. But I have noticed that uh, it seems like the 2018 cars even more than you know some of the last few years. The 2018 seemed to actually be pretty fast. So what we will do, we'll get them up here to the top of the track. And we'll run these bad boys. Another little upgrade just for down the track. I'll show that to you really quick. We we'll now have this track permanently in place that will not slip. And I've saved a ton of these. So I'm continuing to cover the track with cutouts, which I think is turning out pretty sweet. Got some cool cutouts here. Represent flying customs, high speed wheels, color effects, pro circuits, faster than ever, little checkered flag victory lane area here. Some racing champions, matchbox, another matchbox. There's some more flying customs, and that's about as far as I got. But the red pill raceway is coming on together. So, let's get on with this racing. First race, Solar Reflex. Going up against the Road Rocket. We'll get them straight. Got the timer set, here we go. Winner. The new car. I had a good bit. That solar reflex ran a terrible time. 2421. Maybe if I got time on this uh, memory card, we'll run the winner of this overall against that F 150 yesterday. Oh, impromptu King of the Hill style. Ooh, he came back. 2.410. The faster time belongs to Solar Reflex. So, I'm going to try to cut this a little bit shorter, and that's how I'm going to do it. Next up, track camera. Track camera's gonna be facing. Mad fast. I try to remember these times again. Timer is set. There we go. Not even close. Mad fast. Looking mad fast. In lane one. Ran a decent time. Two, four, three, four. Well, I guess not. Pretty terrible. But it seemed like that mad fast was getting it done. So, mad fast can close it out with a win. Or a time faster than two, four, three, four. There we go. Mad fast by a lot. That is a fast time. 2361 left. Close to what that F-150 was running yesterday. That's one to one. Next up. We are gonna have... Get a better shot up here. 2018 Cyber Speeder against the 01 Maelstrom. I feel like both of these cars should be pretty quick. Should be a good matchup. 
Got to set that timer back though. Thanks 3D Bot Maker. Best 50 bucks I've spent since starting this habit slash hobby slash obsession. There we go. New car in one. Oh one and two. Nelson down the hill. Got it. Looking wobbly, but he got it. Two three nine eight for the loser. So Cyber Speeder needs to win and hope that Maelstrom runs slower than a 2382. Cyber Speeder does not do it. It was close. And it's a good thing for the Maelstrom because he ran a slower time, but he won. Sweeps the races. Puts the old cars up. Two to one. The new cars need a win. They're going to be dependent on this for the focus. And the focus has been in the past a fast casting. You know, not, a, not one that you're going to see, not any competition, but it's always been solid. But so has that Pikes Peak Celica. Here we go, race one. Mm. Focus looking fast. I'm trying to get this track as even as I can in one and two. Not easy. Not as fast and down though, maybe I can do it. No, it's close. But it seems like lane two is a little bit faster. Doesn't matter. It's not like it's done. Two, three, eight, four was that one in time. So we tied up in two races. We got the focus and the solar reflex, then we got mad fast and mills from. Race five, let's break the tie. This is gonna be tough for the new cars to win this. These uh both you know can be fast cars. But uh that bulletproof has got his hands full. Love the bulletproof. Never modded one of the others, which I don't know why. Here we go. Oh yeah. A terrible bulletproof. Got his behind kick. All of these have the metal base. Never seen one of the plastic base. I'm thinking about going live here in a little bit and just running some cars. Because all oh, these cars I've actually got this month and I need to run some of these. I did not want to just put them away. So, anyway, time has reset. Oh, didn't swap lanes though. Silly fool. I was wondering what this car will run. Let me find out. Fast car. I think that is about what that F-150 was running yesterday. Of course, the track has been slightly adjusted. Old car is now up. Three to two. The new Viper is in his hands to keep him in it against the O1 Viper. 18 version in one, to O1 and two. Mm. Neither one of fast. The old one wins with a slow time. Two, four, three, one from the new one.
Let's see what happens here. New one has to hope for a win and a slower time than 2 4 3 1. He wins it. But the time for the old one is faster. 2 4 2 3. Not looking good for the new cars. It is now two to four. One more win for the old cars, and it's done. But I feel like, because I think Johnny Lightning, for the most part, sucks. Uh, there's been a couple of castings when it comes to racing. And people want ridiculous money for those, and they're still not faster than the fastest hot wheels. So you ain't gonna see any of those unless I find a deal. Playing with the new Target Decades against the Johnny Lightning 2000. Do it.